And I also think that when you, when you want to conquer a society, you kill the military-aged males. That's what you do. That's the first thing you've, they've ever done. They walk in and all the men have to have their throats cut. They can't perhaps do that, but they can certainly cut your balls off. And then you can't resist. And I think there's certainly a movement to ensure that there's very little resistance left inside of the number one demographic which is required to resist oppression, which are military age males. And they don't want those kind of people waking up with any kind of self-respect or standards or to say, no, I don't accept this. I do not need a ninth injection. They don't want that. They want you to sit and say, mm, I don't need it, but the news said so, so, oh well. So in the one interview that you and I did, you had a line that I've been thinking about ever since. I thought it was so interesting. I never thought of it before. You said that a lot of people went along with the vax yep. and that you didn't judge them because yep. facts change. But now that we know that yep. a lot of what we were told was wrong and some of it was a lie, it is a requirement of your own dignity, of your own self-respect to say so. Completely. And people should apologize. I really do believe.